You're right, Master B. Hungry. I should have eaten. Excuse me, gentlemen. It will come as no surprise I'd like to talk about Indian Hill. I know preliminary investigations have concluded Hugo Strange acted alone. I reject this conclusion. While trapped in Indian Hill, I was led to believe an unnamed group had taken control of my company. And it was they who hired Hugo Strange. I left Gotham both for my own safety and so that I might have the time to discover hard evidence of their existence. <laughs> but I now have proof they exist. And I can tell you that they're here. In this room. I want to talk face to face. You have 24 hours to contact me or the information that I've gathered will be sent to every newspaper and television station in Gotham. Thank you for your time. Right, once this alarm is set, Master Bruce, no coming downstairs till the morning, is that clear? Yes, but was a new alarm system really necessary? I don't know, was it really necessary offering a challenge to a shadowy cabal? Yes, it was necessary, Master Bruce. I wanted to talk. Forgive me. Better? I know you. I've seen you at Wayne Enterprises events. Now, you made a threat. Referring to evidence you'd uncovered of our existence. We would like to know what you found. Nothing certain. Until now. A bluff. Nicely played. It wasn't just a bluff. You're here to make a deal. What do you have to offer? Wayne Enterprises. You cannot give someone what they already possess. I'm not finished. If I die, my shares will be turned over to the federal government. Investigators will comb through every file, every asset. Are you prepared for that kind of scrutiny? That would be unfortunate. I need your answer now. I agree. I'm happy to hear that. Needless to say, you will not see me again. Goodbye, Bruce. Well, I imagine you have some ideas. I do. Dancing lessons. Dancing lessons? That's right. I mean, a man of your station should be able to guide gracefully a beautiful young girl across a dance floor, don't you think? And I suppose that you're going to be teaching me these lessons? Well, I certainly could. You know, I was quite well regarded as a bit of a dancer in my day, actually. Step out. Slowly. Who are you? Please don't hurt me. 
good. So much time, how much time? And again. Good boy. One more time. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Yes. Would you like to try? I, I don't think that's a particularly good idea, do you, Master Bruce? I'm now, Alfred. I think a little exercise before breakfast might be just what he needs. Fine. Here you are. Press that hard against your nose. All right? Here you go. Stem the flow. Good lad. Well, that's a very nasty scar. Where'd you get that? Or can't you remember? What did they do to you in there? Took you long enough. Where's Selena? She's not on her squad. If you did anything... She's fine. Where is she? She left a little while ago. I don't know where she went. I take you in, and this is the thanks I get. You run around with Selena pretending to be me. I don't know what's next, but I know... Would you please just say what you mean? I like you. As more than a friend. It'd be nice if you said something back. How many girls have you dated? What do you mean? <laughs> it's not a trick question. How many girls have you dated? None. None. Rule one, don't ever tell me what I have to do. So you do you have feelings for me? I'm confused. Good. I think we lost them. Is that who you stole the necklace from? Uh, no, I, I don't think so. Then who were they? I don't know. Maybe they work for him. Oh, great, Ivy. One thousand dollars. Fine. Idiot. Two thousand. Fine. Five. No. Ten. What? How much should I ask for? I'll get you five thousand in cash today, or you can try to avoid those men on your own. That's my offer. Big you've gotten. <laughs> you. Gimme. You know, I will never understand rich people's tastes. It's worthless. My father found it at a flea market. I keep it for sentimental reasons. Nice try. Oh, it's got some heft to it. Expensive, I'm guessing. It'd be such a shame if oh, I. No, don't! <sighs> Figure that'd clear the decks. What do you think, huh? Uh, yeah. I remember that night when you took over the benefit. You were quite the showman. Thank you. Always nice to be appreciated. And you're just going to kill me here? It's kind of disappointing. Ah, what do you mean? Look, I know you're just trying to buy time so you can escape. But your point is still valid. 
Sound up, boys. We're taking the show on the road. And I know just the spot. Come on. <laughs> Not you, old chap. The Prince of Gotham deserves a public death. His butler, not so much. Kill him. No, Bruce! This is what we've been training for. Oh, I love this game. One, please. You, sir. Oh, no, 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 no. Please. No, no, no. You won't get away with it. Harry did. Now, shush. Need to concentrate. A few dozen brainwashed maniacs can't keep the city hostage forever. Well, duh. So what's the point? Gotham has no heroes. No! 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 Hey! Hey! Val! He pushed me. You see that? You want to kill someone? Let's get on with it. Come on! You're so boring, Bruce. No! no! Did that hurt? Not much. You tried. Stop! <laughs> Stop! <laughs> All right. Enough dilly dally. To the main event. Force just arrived, they're coming in. Kids this close with their butlers. Oh. This is about doing what's right. You wanna be a hero? Tell you what, buddy. I'll give you a fighting chance. Let's do this mano y mano. My little conquistador. Come on. What kind of hero time does someone remind Tell you that I don't like clowns. Well, in a couple of days, you'll be back to your old self. I guarantee it. You ready to tell me what happened? When Jerome took me away, I thought they were going to kill you. Him felt. It felt right. Felt like justice. There's a very fine line, Master Bruce, between justice and vengeance. I know. But that doesn't mean there isn't one. No, it doesn't. 
I knew where the line was tonight, Alfred. I didn't cross it. Never mind what the reason. Never mind what the circumstance. I will not kill. Say it again. I will not kill. Then let's get to work. Oh, does that shock your tender sensibility? He's a thief. I'm a thief. You can't trust him. But I can trust you. Look, I'm sorry. I should have told you I suspected your mother of lying. I was trying to protect these I Marina. can protect myself. Just go home, Bruce. You don't belong here. Why'd you ask me here if you're going to be this way? So about that money. My <laughs> turn. Stand down there, boy, big boy. Oh, who is that? Big boy. Oh. Like looking into a mirror. Powerful knockout truck. Why? This is what I was made for. To be Bruce Wayne. Plus some sort of maze, is that it? Everything is a maze, Bruce. The only difference is whether we realize our place within it. Given enough time, I will find a way out. How much time? So much the teacher, Bruce. But your pain, it blocks you from who I need you to become. Who Gotham needs you to become. Are we going back to the alley where my parents were murdered? 
No. It's another memory I want to start with. The first time you felt the rage after your parents' death, do you remember? Yes. Why me? Because you need each other. Gotham needs a protector, and you need a purpose. I'm only trying to show you the way, but it has to be your choice. I heard what they were saying. He witnessed the whole thing. He must have been terrible. Devastated. Traumatized. My parents were dead, but all anybody was talking about was me. How concerned they were about me. My parents had been murdered. Gunned down and left for dead and nobody seemed... Angry. Yes. Yeah. You can lock it away and once you do, you'll be free of the power it holds over you. Bruce, together, we will make Gotham pay. Is that all you have? I thought you wanted to leave this place. That's it. That's it. Yes. See what you can accomplish once you remove destructive emotions? Tell me. I can take it away, and you can return to Gotham with a power you never thought possible. It's your choice. Get up. We're not done. Thank you. Tell me, how do you feel now when you think of your parents' murder? I feel... nothing. I told you the truth. We will destroy the Court of Owls, and in so doing, you will become the perfect weapon for you will do what Ever I say, won't you? Yes. Three years ago, a great crime was committed. Thomas and Martha Wayne were murdered. Their blood is on the court's hands, on your hands. Thomas Wayne stood against the court. He threatened to expose us. He paid the price. And my mother? She had to die as well. You hesitated. Next time I won't. I promise. No. I know you won't. I want to help you. I want to reverse what he's done to you. Bruce, if you press that detonator, there's no coming back. He won't shoot you. He's weak, Bruce. But you are not. Bruce, please. Please. Give me the detonator, son. No. You will press it.
He died. But he completed his task. The Court of Owls is destroyed. Gotham burns. And you are here. He told me to complete my training. To find the demon's head. You already have, Bruce. I'm the one you seek. I'm the demon's head. I am Raish al Ghul. The sensei trained me. Are you? He set you a task. He asked you to be the one that released the virus that now envelops this city. You failed. I would have. But Alfred, he, he distracted me. I know. I know. And that's why I'm going to give you another chance to complete your journey. I don't know it's so surprised, Master Bruce. I told you you couldn't get rid of me that easy. It's got a bit sloppy. Got a bit of ring rust. Let these little ninja monkeys get one over on me. You're right, mate. Well, you come as. Enough. He's wrong. Master Bruce, there's no other way to put it. He's wrong. Your destiny is to be Bruce Wayne. And one day you're gonna remember that. And you're gonna remember how much I love you. So this is what you need to do. Master Bruce, you crack on. You do it. through your conditioning. <laughs> Impressive. You don't control me anymore! I will never be your heir! I'm sorry, Alfred. It wasn't your fault, was it? I completely lost my way. I've been trying to find who I am for so long, searching for some greater meaning. I don't know who I am, Alfred. Who am I supposed to be? You need to find your true north. And let that guide you. What's yours? You. It's always been you. You gotta find something that you really care about. And you protect it at all costs. Please. <laughs> <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> it was such a good... <laughs> <laughs> it was great, whatever it was. Money! Now! Dad! It's, it's okay, sweetheart. Now! 